Grand Cape Mount County is arguably the most scenic of the 15 counties comprising the landscape of the West African nation of Liberia. With its lush vegetation, mountain range, and large island dotted lake, and pristine Atlantic coast beaches, Cape Mount County has unlimited potential. After over a decade of civil war in Liberia, Cape Mount, like many other parts of Liberia, was severely destroyed and set back many decades. In the United States, citizens from this county who refer to themselves as Cape Mountainians are committed to assisting in the recovery and reconstruction of the county. NACA has a track record of accomplishments, especially in the areas of health care, where we reopened and funded the St. Timothy's Hospital Outpatient Services. We shipped medical supplies, funded midwife training to help reduce the incidence of fatality during childbirth, and we've also assisted in the area of education with scholarships, textbooks, and now plans for teacher incentives to attract more math and science teachers at the high school level. We've also ventured into infrastructure development where we've taken on a very ambitious project, the Conja Bridge over a creek that turns into a raging river during the rainy season in Liberia. We invite friends and potential visitors to join our efforts to rebuild a nation even as we extend into enterprises that provide economic empowerment to the people of Cape Mount. Just to name a few recent accomplishments in Liberia, NACA purchased and distributed junior and senior high textbooks and dictionaries to all 16 junior and senior high schools in Cape Mount and funded the transportation and distribution of classroom furniture and other school supplies donated to the schools by non-governmental organizations in Liberia. We also lobbied for support to complete the Conjur Bridge through meetings with prominent citizens and key government officials, including the Deputy Minister of Public Works for Technical Services. We also completed the public works process for construction permitting NACA also hosted a very fruitful stakeholders meeting at which county and district officials, education officers, university students, teachers, school principals, community leaders, parents, etc., held important discussions regarding education in the county. I want to take this time to extend my appreciation to Mr. Abbas Kamara of the Kip Mount Development Foundation who has managed NACA's activities with exceptional professionalism and integrity. I also extend to Senator James K. Momo of Cape Mount my sincere gratitude for his provision of two weeks of transportation to facilitate travel throughout the county, as well as his personal participation and support of activities conducted during this important visit. My commitment to NACA from the United States of America is that uh, I will serve as their transportation officer here. So if you, anyone wants to see my car, see my car with NACA, that's my commitment. Special thanks also to the NACA leadership team for their hard work and many sacrifices to make it a successful year. One of the ways we convince people to give us money is to show that when we get that money, we use it properly and it delivers results. I challenge you all to think of what it is that you can contribute to this effort. Please think about some of the things that you have the power to do. For more information, go to www.capemountusa.org.